Libra, what's going on, baby? Happy Tuesday. I hope you all have a beautiful day. What's up, Libra? Welcome back. Those of you that's returning and welcome if you are new and tapping in for the first time. I'm happy to have each and every one of you here with me. Libra, let's see what's going on in the energy. <laughs> let's see what messages Spirit has for y'all today. Take only what resonates with you and leave the rest for somebody else out there. All right, Libra, this is for Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and North Node placements. Libra, 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 Libra. Libra, there's monitoring spirits, okay? There's a lot of monitoring spirits. You may be um, realizing that, that there's a lot of monitoring spirits, ugh, monitoring spirits around you, okay? It's like, what the fuck, bro? Back the fuck up. <laughs> That's the energy that I'm picking up on. Like, yo, go ahead. Motherfuckers work, they work 24 7, 365, 366 in Alipia. Motherfuckers working around the clock. I'm like, what type of payroll they got y'all monitoring spirits on? Because y'all are always on the clock. <laughs> if you know, you know, Libra, but that's all right. Let them look, let them watch, let them report back to their motherfuckers and shit. <laughs> Libra, what's up, pumpkin? What's up, darling? What's up, sugar? Libra, 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 Libra. We are going to jump right into the tarot. All right, get you some messages, Libra. See what's going on. Let's see what's in the energy for y'all. Take only what resonates and leave the rest for somebody else out there. This is for Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and North Node Libra placements. Cross watches for Libra. The roles are interchangeable. Everybody's situation is different. Please flip and bounce the roles as you see fit to your personal situations. Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and North Node. Libra, what's going on? What's going on, Libra? Libra, thank you for supporting me in the channel. I love y'all. Y'all have been amazing. Y'all have been amazing. Y'all continue to do me good. Libra, you do me good. I'm going to do you better, shorty. <laughs> What's up, Libra? Somebody here mad because you blocked them. Somebody here is mad because you're not talking to them. Somebody here feels blocked. They feel ignored by you. There's some shit like that that's going on. Somebody here feels blocked. They feel ignored. <sighs> Somebody here like, damn, Libra, you don't want to talk to me. Somebody here could have been waiting to receive something. They realized that they, that shit is never coming. They're not getting anything. I don't know what this is pertaining to, but this is the overall energy and the pre-shuffle. So somebody here was received, somebody here was waiting to receive something, and now they're unhappy because they realize dun, 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 you ain't getting shit. Okay, somebody here realizes that they're not getting nothing. Somebody here is very codependent. They're like, what you mean I'm not getting anything? Motherfucker, you ain't getting nothing. Somebody here could have been waiting on some money. Somebody here thought they was about to get some money. They thought they was about to get some funds. That shit came to a tower. That shit came to an end. You're getting nothing. You get nothing. There's nothing coming in for you. Libra, that is justice for you, okay? Justice is being served in your favor. There you are, Libra energy, justice and upright. But somebody else is unhappy because they was waiting on something and they realized dun, 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 they ain't getting shit, okay? I'm hearing somebody's not getting anything. Like somebody was expecting something and they're not getting anything. The only thing that they're getting is a tower moment. Dun, 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 extreme tower moment, okay? This person is very hateful, all right? They showing up as a king of cups in the reverse. This person don't have an ounce of love in their heart, but they was expecting some sort of blessings. Lord, make it stop. <laughs> Lord. Jesus, help these people. Yeah, somebody here thought that the devil was going to help them and the devil was going to give them something. The devil was going to help them celebrate. Oh, the devil was going to give me something big. The devil promised me this. The devil promised people a lot of shit. You ain't getting nothing, though. Shit. <laughs> somebody ain't getting a damn thing they're like what you mean what you mean somebody here's upset man somebody here could be a capricorn or a gemini somebody here can have capricorn or gemini placements but somebody here is like what are you talking about there's no way yeah libra you showing up as a high priestess and an earth angel look at this shit high priestess and the temperance energy somebody here want to come towards you on some bullshit somebody here was trying to sneak you snake you okay somebody here was really trying to come for you in some way somebody here could have an aquarius moon possibly give me something on this uh seven of swords four of wands in the reverse yeah but that cycle has closed out 
Yeah, somebody here wants to take your gifts, take your divine inheritance, take your blessings. Somebody here was trying to block you from having a new beginning, trying to cause issues and conflict for you in your life. But you still get to celebrate, Libra. You choose peace, you choose celebration, you choose happiness. And that's exactly what you're fully aligned with, okay? I'm hearing you are going into a soft life. This is your period of restoration, okay? You are welcoming in a soft life. Abundance is your birthright. All right, and somebody here was trying to take that away from you. Abundance is your birthright. Welcome to the soft life, okay? Libra, period. You could be seeing angel number 888 during this time. There's an emperor in the reverse that's pissed off. They got conflict surrounding them. This person is under heavy judgment. They feel exposed in some way, all right? Somebody here is going through a lot of karma. Wheel of Fortune in the reverse, the Ten of Wands. Everything is back on this person. They feel like they're being seen as a thief. They're being seen as a liar. They're being seen as someone that just causes a muck, okay? This person is a shit starter, okay? This person just started a lot of shit in your life, okay? For no good reason. But we have the star card here, Libra. You're showing up as someone that's being vindicated. You are showing up as a healer. Some of you may, you may actually do some sort of healing work. You could be a light worker. You could work for the divine. You are showing up as a high priestess, an earth angel, high priestess, temperance, and a star. So some of you definitely work for the divine. You could be a light worker. You could be a messenger, okay? But I'm telling you, you are a healer. Okay, and you have healed from whatever this person was trying to do to you. Yeah, for some of you, this person was trying to kill you off. Okay, I keep getting that message. I hate saying that shit. I'm so over it. It's so redundant. But Libra, somebody here also wanted to put an end into your happiness, to your relationships, to your partnerships, to your business. Okay, but your business is blossoming. Everything is booming for you. Everything is increasing in your life. Okay, I'm hearing there's a supernatural increase in your life, Libra. Yes, that's your karmic justice. That's your good karma. Justice in the upright to the fool. You are showing up as someone that's powerful, brave, fearless, and you being rewarded for being in that energy, Libra. Okay, I'm hearing that you have great partnerships that you're going to be establishing with people. Okay, you are meeting members of your soul family, your soul tribe. That's a beautiful thing, Libra. So you are definitely meeting your people. Okay, people that are not going to be in competition with you. People that are not going to be jealous of you. People that's going to genuinely want to see you win, be happy for you. People that are going to celebrate you. People that you can learn and grow and evolve with. Okay, those are the type of people that you are aligning with during this time. It's a beautiful moment for you. It's a beautiful time in your life. And somebody here that wanted to block all your connections and relationships. Somebody here wanted to isolate you and destroy you. This person is now under heavy judgment for doing this shit. This person now feels binded in some way. Meanwhile, you are receiving divine, but you just, you're receiving divine blessings, divine gifts. Ace of Pentacles here, Three of Cups, the Hierophant. There's a lot of stability surrounding you. Stability, security, okay? Everything is secured. Solid foundation. A lot of stability coming in for you. Yeah, this is something that you've manifested. You have multiple people here that are unhappy. Somebody here could have worked together with a whole family. This could be this emperor in reverse in their karmic family. Or this could even be members of your karmic family. Just take it as it resonates, Libra. But all of these people are under judgment together. Okay, they're all under judgment together. I'm hearing everybody's under judgment. Judgment in reverse, will of fortune reverse, the tables have turned. Any and everybody that was wishing you ill in some way, shape, or form, that shit is being mirrored back to them. That's the fucking truth, Ace of Swords. I ain't gonna lie to you. Libra, somebody here is saying that they in love with you, okay? But you are celebrating, okay? Confirmation. You're focused on your celebrations, okay? A lot of victory and success for you. Three of Cups, Six of Wands, okay? Your hard work is paying off. Your hard work is paying off, Libra. Everything that you did is paying off. It was all worth it, okay? Your inner work and whatever it is that you've been investing in as far as your career or whatever it is that you've been working on whatever it is that you've been trying to grow okay that you've been trying to see something grow you've been trying to see something grow you've been watering your seeds your flowers are now blooming this is your blooming season libra okay you are booming you are blooming okay and there's a king of pentacles in the reverse that's very unhappy there could be a capricorn or a leo or somebody with that highly aspect in their chart that's unhappy there's also a cancer that's unhappy there's multiple masculines and feminine energies that all feel blocked okay somebody's upset because they can't attach to your energy. Somebody here wanted to attach some sort of energetic core to your energy so that they can manifest off of your sacral chakra. Okay, that's what I just heard. But somebody here can no longer do this. They can't do this. Somebody here is being removed from your energetic field permanently. Okay, somebody here is being permanently removed and they cannot penetrate your energetic field anymore. Somebody here could even be getting sick. Okay, somebody here is very bitter. They're very mad. Strong Leo energy here. Cancer and Capricorn could be significant. But these people are bitter. They're mad. Okay, they could be a, a Scorpio that's upset too, a Virgo. Yeah, 
Somebody here sees you as someone that's very intelligent, very wise. Somebody here is watching you receive blessings, okay? Somebody here wants to watch you receive blessings. They want to know when it comes in. There's an empress in the reverse that's pissed. This could be a karmic mother figure, okay? This could be your actual mom or just a karmic mother figure here, but... There's a distorted feminine of empress in the reverse that's watching you during this time. This person feels like they're facing poverty. They could be getting a message that they are losing something or something is being taken away from them. They're upset. This person could be feeling like they're out in the cold. This person is very restless. This person has been wishing poverty and ill on you for a long time. And that shit has finally caught up to them. All right. So it looks like everybody is getting everything that they wished for. Libra, you was wishing for abundance. You was wishing for love, peace, harmony. You're getting that. These people was wishing poverty, illness, sickness, and endings. They're getting that. They was wishing it on you. They're getting that. You was wishing good things for yourself. You're getting that. Everybody's getting what they wished for. These people should have been focused on wishing great things for themselves instead of wishing ill on you because this is the season of everybody getting what they've been, uh, the seeds they've been planting. Everybody is getting whatever they've been planting. So if you've been planting shit, now you got a big bowl of shit in your life. 11, 11, 1 o'clock as I say that. And if you've been planting great things, okay, you got beautiful flowers that's blooming. That's it. It's, it's the season of the eight. Okay. 2024. This is year eight. This is karmic. Like this is what's happening here. This is universal law, karmic law. This is the law of attraction. What have you been investing in? What have you been focused on? If you've been focused on tearing people down and that's exactly what the fuck is about to happen. Your life is about to be torn the fuck apart. And if you've been focused on building for yourself, then that's exactly what's about to happen. Everything's about to be growing for you. This is the year eight. Okay. 2024 year eight. You shall bear, you shall reap what you have sown. You shall bear the fruits of your labor. If you were spending time wishing ill on people and attacking people, I hope you're ready for that energy to be returned to you tenfold. And if you've been busting your ass and creating and building for yourself, then I hope that you're prepared for your blessings. Your dreams are coming true during this time. Libra, what side of the wheel you on? What have you been doing? What have you been doing, Sugar Snaps? Libra, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, North No, Libra. Some of you have a fire sign that's holding on to you. Some of you have an Aquarius that's holding on to you. Strong fire, strong Aquarius energy. Somebody knows that you're protected. Somebody knows that you're focused on your work. You're focused on your craft. This person is saying that they want to hold on to you. Okay, this is somebody that don't want to cycle to close out between you two. But I feel like whoever this is, you don't trust this person. Okay, this person is worried. They're concerned about their finances. There's also a Gemini here that could be concerned about their finances. We have Gemini in the reverse, Aquarius in the reverse, Scorpio in the reverse, fire energy here. My income is constantly increasing. It's in the reverse here. Okay, yeah, more Gemini energy here. And if there was a Gemini that was trying to connect with you, that you are trusting your intuition and you know that this is not your person. If there was an Aquarius or a Scorpio trying to connect with you, you know that this is not your person. Somebody here wants you to see them as your person, as your divine counterpart, when they are not. This person is worried about their finances, and that's why they want to partner up with you. I can't make it up. Strong Aquarius. Somebody here is a Gemini, an Aquarius, a Scorpio, or a fire sign, or they can have all of that in their chart. But whoever this is, they see you as someone that's very intuitive. They see you as someone that's very abundant. This person feels like you are a magnet, like a money magnet in some way. And this person is concerned about their future, whatever it is that they got going on. And so they're going deep within and trying to figure out how they could be your emperor. This person is not your emperor. Yeah, this person is seeing you as a money opportunity. <laughs> you could also be receiving a money opportunity. But somebody here was trying to block you from receiving career opportunities from somebody who was trying to block your abundance, block your wealth, uh, block your prosperity. Okay. Like somebody here was trying to block that. And now their shit is blocked. It's all the way blocked. Like somebody here ain't nothing coming in for this person. This person feel like that shit is dried up. Okay. Their cup empty as fuck. 
Like somebody here feels like their cup is empty. But this is what somebody wished on you, Libra. Now somebody's unhappy because that shit is being returned to somewhere. Somebody here could be a Leo or a Taurus. Yeah, Libra, you are showing up as the Empress. Okay, you are showing up as the Empress, Libra. There you go, showing up as the Empress. You always have a choice, Libra. What you want to do? You want to repeat a karmic cycle or you want to move forward? A lot of you are choosing to transform, to elevate, and to go in a new direction. You going in a new direction is the best thing that you could have did, Libra. Six of Wands, making head over heart decisions here. Yeah, Six of Wands. This is you being celebrated, okay? Judgment is being called in this situation. You are fully tapped into your Empress energy. You going through this transformation was the best thing that you could have did. Releasing the past, out with the old and with the new. You're not repeating karmic cycles. You're not repeating lessons that you've already learned here. You could have had another Libra going against you. This person is going through an extreme tile moment during this time. All of these people are going through an extreme tile moment. There's a Gemini, an Aquarius, a Leo, another Libra, a Scorpio. All going through extreme tile moments right now for fucking with you. The will has indeed turned, okay? Will of Fortune in reverse. There's also a Capricorn that's getting that ass whooped during this time as well. All of these people wanted to be your op. All of these people wanted to be your op, Libra. I'm hearing the table have turned. These motherfuckers is barely holding on. They holding on for their life. That will done turned. That shit done shifted so fast, so swiftly, so quick. Okay? Somebody here clutching their motherfucking pearls. These people clutching their motherfucking pearls. Libra, I promise you they clutching their pearls. Libra. Libra, Libra. Okay. Judgment. Told you. Judgment being called in the situation. Judgment card want to come out. I'll leave it out. Yep. Will of Fortune in reverse right behind it. Come on now. I ain't going to bullshit y'all. I ain't going to bullshit you, baby. Judgment in the upright. Will of Fortune in reverse. That will done turn so motherfucking fast. It's making their head spin. I'm telling you. Somebody here hanging on for their life. They on the opposite side of the wheel. Oh, my God, I was not ready for this judgment. I was not ready for this karma. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, somebody here wanted to block your new beginning, block your creativity, block your protection, block everything that could be good for you. That's what somebody was wishing. They was wishing ill on you. They wanted to block everything you had going good. Yep, somebody here is very jealous of you. Somebody here is very angry. They're mad because you get to sail the karma waters. You are showing up as the queen of pentacles, Libra. Very independent, very self-sufficient, very abundant, financially stable. Okay, you got blessings on the way, ace of pentacles. Some of you could be receiving a home or you could be moving into a new home. You could be building a family with someone. Congratulations. You are showing up as the empress, Libra. You keep showing up as the empress that you are. Somebody here is heavily burdened and weighed down. They came for a whole goddess, a whole empress. Somebody here sees you in your nine of cups, okay? Very independent, very self-sufficient. You're going to be very happy, okay? You're bearing the fruits of your labor. You've been working really hard because this is a lot of fruits, okay? You going from the nine of pentacles to the ten of pentacles, the nine of cups to the ten of cups, empress. This is a beautiful time for you, okay? This is really, really beautiful. Wow, Libra. Your dreams are coming true. I'm hearing that all your dreams are coming true. Your wish fulfillment is here. I love this for you. Yeah, this cycle has closed out with these ops, these enemies, these people that wanted to destroy you. This cycle has closed out. Yeah, the cycle has closed out with the devil. The devil is no longer in your life. The devil has been casted away. I'm hearing any demonic contract with your name on it has been dismantled, destroyed, and ripped apart. It has been shredded, okay? It has been forfeited. There is no more demonic contracts with your name on it. It's over. Libra, you free. Baby, I'm hearing you free. You free. This was bigger than you. This was bigger than your eyes. You're free. Somebody here is pissed off about this. Temperance in the reverse. You was not supposed to be free. That's how somebody feel. Somebody here can't believe that you are breaking generational curses, that you're going to have real love in your life. So some of you may come from a bloodline that was cursed, and nobody in your bloodline ever experienced like real true love. Maybe these people don't really get married. And if they do get married, it's like karmic marriages. It's not real, true, divine love. But you're the person that's going to get true, divine love. And somebody here is upset that you're the one that's getting that. Okay? What makes you so special that you're getting true, divine love? You're the one that's healing, though. That's what's going on here. You're the one that's actually choosing to do the work. Yeah, the Hierophant. And God is blessing you. You are being put in a position of power. You are showing up as a leader. 
you are being deemed worthy of this position. You have showed your loyalty to the creator, the most high father God himself. And your loyalty, your strength, your bravery, and your courage, your wisdom is, is what's holding you in this position. Yeah, you held in high honor, Libra. You showing up as the high priestess. I can't make it up. And somebody here is really upset about this. Somebody here could even be depressed. Somebody here feel like they missed out on an opportunity to block you and trap you and keep you stuck. They was never going to trap you and keep you stuck. This was already written, Libra. God knew that you would pass this test. This was already written for you. Yeah, time went to reverse. History repeats itself. This was already written. These people are going through an extreme tower moment, wishing that they would have never went up against you. All right. Somebody here is receiving some sort of bad news about some sort of spell work backfiring on them as well. This was three people, up to three people or more collaboration. These people continue to do these spells and somebody here is getting sick. Somebody here is angry. Okay. These people don't want to give up here. Somebody here is doing voodoo is what I'm hearing. Somebody here could be another Libra like you, a Leo. This could be a couple for some of you. Somebody here could have strong Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or Leo in their chart. There's a masculine and a feminine energy that's been playing in your energy for far too long. Somebody here is going to lose their life if they don't stop. Yep, these people could be going through a breakup or a divorce, or they just being separated because somebody's going to lose their life if they don't stop, like I just said. Libra, you are showing up as the healer, the star, the empress, and the star. You are so powerful, Libra. Wow. Just look at the power in these cards as well. Like, are y'all really picking this shit up? Like, look at the Empress and the Star in this deck. Like, this is so beautiful. Y'all see the Empress and the Star in this deck? Like, Libra, what? Baby, do you know who you are, honey? You know who you are now. If you had any doubt after this situation, this, this last cycle, yeah, you know exactly who you are. Somebody here is unhappy because they feel like you're still into calmer waters. You're walking away from them. You don't trust them. You don't want to invest in them. You're not giving them shit. Somebody here knows that death is coming. Somebody here is sad. They're worried. They're scared. They know death is near. They also know that there's just a lot of endings that's going to be happening in their, in their life. A death to their finances, poverty, health, everything is just fucked up. Everything is fucked up. These people failed. They failed their test. Their test was to serve you, to be good to you. And they went up against you. They failed their test. They cursed themselves. These people are now cursed. You start in your own lineage. I'm hearing that you are being separated from these people, even if they are in your bloodline. It's like you have a whole new contract. You start in your own bloodline. It's like you start in your own family elsewhere. These people are watching you in heavy regret. Somebody here is waiting for you to be binded. That's not going to happen. There's a queen of cups that's waiting for you to be binded. That's not going to happen. This person is stuck. They're codependent. And they're under some sort of illusion that you're going to be stuck. Everything I'm saying is the truth, Ace of Swords. Stuck where? You ain't stuck nowhere. You moving forward freely. Fuck you talking about? <laughs> These people are fucking wishful thinking, okay? They're real hopeful. Yeah, I'm hopeful. Yes, I am. Hopeful for today. <laughs> These people are real hopeful. They got high hopes, big dreams and high hopes. <laughs> big dreams and high hopes. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Libra, I'm going to talk to y'all. Have a beautiful day. Peace.